In 1816, the world experienced a year unlike any other a year where summer never came. Known as the year without a summer, this bizarre and catastrophic period brought unseasonably cold temperatures, failed harvests, and widespread famine. But hidden within this tale of hardship are stories of resilience, creativity, and the human spirit's ability to adapt to even the most unpredictable challenges. What caused the year without a summer? The origins of this climatic anomaly can be traced back to April 1815, when Mount Tambora, a massive volcano in Indonesia, erupted with unimaginable force. It was one of the most powerful volcanic eruptions in recorded history, releasing vast amounts of ash and sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere. These particles formed a veil that encircled the Earth, blocking sunlight and cooling global temperatures. This volcanic winter disrupted weather patterns across the northern hemisphere. Snow fell in July, rivers froze in summer, and crops withered under an unrelenting cold that seemed to defy the natural order of seasons. The sun was dimmed, casting an eerie glow across the skies a harbinger of the struggles to come. The struggles of ordinary people. For farmers in New England, the effects were devastating. One Vermont farmer described waking up in June to find his fields covered in frost. It felt as though winter had returned overnight. He wrote in his journal, Livelihoods were destroyed as crops failed to grow, leaving families with little to eat and even less to sell. In Europe, the situation was no better. France and Germany, already reeling from the Napoleonic Wars, faced widespread famine as food shortages led to skyrocketing prices. Bread riots erupted in cities, and governments struggled to maintain order. Even in Switzerland, known for its temperate summers, heavy snow fell in July, forcing villagers to slaughter livestock prematurely, knowing they would not survive the long winter ahead. The ripple effects of the famine reached far beyond individual communities. The Irish potato crop, a staple for millions, suffered greatly, exacerbating the already dire conditions that would later culminate in the Irish potato famine of the 1840s. Creativity amid catastrophe. Despite the darkness, both literal and metaphorical the year, without a summer, also inspired remarkable acts of creativity and innovation. In Switzerland, a group of writers, stranded by unrelenting storms, gathered in a villa by Lake Geneva. Among them was Mary Shelley, who, inspired by the ominous weather and her own fears, began penning Frankenstein. The novel would go on to become one of the most enduring works of Gothic literature, a testament to how art can emerge from adversity. In the United States, the crop failure spurred one man, Jethro Wood, to improve the design of the plow. His invention revolutionized agriculture, enabling farmers to till land more efficiently and prepare for future challenges. The harsh conditions also accelerated emigration to the western territories of the U.S. as families sought new opportunities in less affected regions. This migration played a pivotal role in shaping the expansion of America and the development of its frontier spirit. A wake-up call from history the year without a summer serves as a stark reminder of the fragility of our environment and the profound impact that natural events can have on human society. Today, as we grapple with climate change and its far-reaching consequences, the lessons of 1816 feel more relevant than ever. The global cooling caused by Mount Tambora's eruption was a natural event beyond human control. However, it revealed how interconnected the world is how a volcanic eruption in Indonesia could bring hardship to families in Europe and America. In today's era of global warming, the stakes are even higher as human activities significantly influence the climate. Resilience through adversity. What makes the story of the year without a summer inspiring is not just a catastrophe itself, but the resilience shown by people who endured it. They adapted, innovated, and found ways to survive in a world turned upside down. Their experiences offer a powerful message. While we cannot control every challenge life throws our way, we can control how we respond. Whether it's through fostering creativity, supporting one another, or working collectively to address larger issues, the spirit of resilience that emerged in 1816 remains a guiding light for our times.
Just as Mary Shelley transformed the eerie glow of dim sunlight into a masterpiece, we too can find ways to turn today's challenges into opportunities for growth and innovation. Conclusion The Year Without a Summer stands as both a cautionary tale and a source of inspiration. It reminds us of nature's unpredictability and the importance of preparedness, but it also celebrates humanity's ability to persevere and thrive against all odds. By learning from history, we can face the future with courage, creativity, and hope qualities that remain timeless, regardless of the storms we encounter.